Well, this video has been waiting a long time coming. But anyways, as you can see from my channel, I've not been releasing as much Thomas videos recently because I've been focusing more on the ponies. Plus also the fact that I'm seeing them to go to conventions now. Those of you who do not know, I am unfortunately not going to BronyCon this year, but I'm looking into it for 2016. Though, it might, mostly it won't happen, but hoping to go to Quest 3 LA in September. And then odds are looking towards me to go to Ponyville Cyphus this November in Milwaukee, which I'll finally be able to get Applejack and Rainbow Dash signed, like my other ponies have gotten signed. Like, well, like Rarity here, as we know. But, I have here the, probably some of the first times I wanted to get from the Trackmaster 2.0 stuff of when they first came out. Besides, well, the set with James and Gator that I first got last August. And then, here I got, as you can see, the Avalanche Escape set and Essential Engine Escape Pack. Now, for those of you who know, Sora Legend of the Lost Treasure is coming out soon. And of course, it'll be a cool new set coming out with that, where Thomas is going to be able to swaddle down. Hoping to get that soon. And hopefully it won't be as late as this. And of course, this is nowhere near as late as, let's say, the King of the Railway set was, or the Castle Quest. Which that will be probably one of my last Trackmaster 1 I might ever get, unless, let's say, I can come across stuff, let's say, on eBay, or, let's say, stuff I'm lucky to find at, let's say, place smaller stores and things like that. Plus, I also got the Essential Engines gift pack here, which would be pretty cool. Get some characters. I got a specialized Thomas, which is like my fourth Thomas from this series so far, apart from this one and the ones from the set where Thomas Sting was on one rail, and then the LB and the CR Thomas and the Thomas and the Snowy set. Calls like my first Percy and Gordon from this series, as well as my first Diesel. My third James, because as you know, I got the Scary James and the James from that other Tale of Brave set. But anyways, enough babbling, let's dive on in. Slide around through this little nail file thing is always coming in handy when you don't have scissors. There we go. And let's pop this set open. Okay. Got some stuff. Let's slide on out. Well, box is empty, but can't toss it off now because I still have bought Thomas. I got Thomas for you, so box. Bye bye. Okay, let's get him out. Let's pull some more tape off. So, let me have at it. Look at that, Thomas is free. Let's clear this out of the way and I'm going to start assembling. I'll be back with you guys once this set's all assembled. Hmm, here's a feature that reminds me of a past Thomas set from last year. And it's that we have a rock here that goes in here like how last year we had the little crown that went in a spot similar to this. Alright, now I got Thomas's battery all in and all that. And I did my usual mods. I do these Trackmaster 2 engines with black buffers. So, Thomas is now running. Let's test him out. Let's test him out with this car, which actually has a little nub thing on here that's used to push a little trigger in it, because I was just playing around the set to figure out how it works, so that's how I figured it out. And it's kind of similar to something that, let's say, is on the older Trackmaster set that came out last year. Well, 2013. The King of the Railway set. But, let me get this all fitted in. We'll see what this thing's got, and maybe have a little fun. And then, also, we gotta keep up with what I was saying and open these guys up, too. We'll do that once Thomas is all set up. Yeah, as you can see, it's kind of down because I've been already been playing around with it. Running off, are you, little Thomas? Yeah, there we go. We got pop-in feature. Got this cool thing. You can see Thomas collects a little rock. Mario. 
Anyways, let's have a little fun. You know what will happen when this happens? Thomas falls off the tracks. Ah, screw it. I'm bored. Let's have some fun and get these guys out. Now we're having fun. Let's get them out. Ooh. Characters. It's always fun popping these guys out of their containers. Boxing shot. Looking video style. And some instructions. Don't need this. Mr. Garbage Man's going to be really happy on Monday. No, wait, it's Tuesday. It'll be happening. But we got the characters with Gordon with his unusually fat boiler, which is reasonably fat because of all the battery compartments. Same with James. That's why I've noticed it's pretty awkward and odd. Anyways, I think. Let's get these guys rolling. Start off with oh, Thomas, our looking Thomas. Let's add Gordon to the mix. Can Thomas rescue the tunnel before Gordon gets up? He did it! And can Gordon do the same for Thomas? Yes! Gordon saved Thomas. It's close, it's close. Yes! Thomas saved the day. But it's like Gordon's a little bit faster for Thomas. <clears throat> okay. Disaster! I knew that was gonna happen. Look at that. Gordon went off the rails. Let's add James to the mix and see what'll happen. I think Gordon is the fastest one of these models. Well, he's the fastest engine in the show. And that was so really close. And James derailed. And Thomas crashed too. Let's try the best bro of Thomas, or best friend. Percy.
Thomas saves the track for Percy. <clears throat> Percy's running really slow. And he just lost his van. <laughs> oh gosh. No! Percy! Let's try Diesel out. Time to save the day. There you go, Diesel. Now you gotta do the same in return. You did it! What? Okay, why did Thomas fail? Hmm. Let's try Teasel out with two vans and see how it goes. See if he can hang on for his life. Oh, he did it! Diesel did it! I stuck off the hill, but he did it again! Albeit with a rattling truck. Well, that's not gonna end good. Alright, it did end good. Oh, there's a rock on the tracks! No! Oh, Diesel pushed the rock out of the way. Let's try adding someone to push Diesel off. Diesel pushes Thomas down. I don't think Leo was able to do this, but now we got Thomas with Annie and Clairwell on the set. Kind of between different. Now the old Tony ones too. The Thomas is kind of struggling. But he's got this. Whoa! He just killed his passengers! Let's do that again. And note, these are the older Tommy Annie and Clairwell because I never got my hands in the track ones. And yes, I saw them in stores, but I never got around to getting them because I was more into getting stuff like, let's say, the, you know, like, Stafford and, yeah, they're just like that. Come on, Thomas. You did it the first time, you can do it again. Whoa! It must be the coupling system that's hurting Thomas. Let's try this older 2010-2012-ish Thomas on the system. It's climbing up. Doing a good job so far. I'm going to go slow with... Come on, Thomas. Use your traction. Use those traction tires I gave you. Come on! Come on! Come on! Don't think you could do this with a load, but he's got this. And now he doesn't got this. Well, it probably isn't the best one of my Thomas's I got. He's kind of stuttering and slow. He's gonna fail. I think he's gonna fail. Come on, Thomas! You can do this! <clears throat> Don't let me down! He let me down. Let's try Paxton instead and see how he does. Well, he's moving a lot faster than Thomas is, that's for sure. I mean, look, that was nothing. And then he crashed. Well, you know what they say about Trackmaster 2? It's not fully compatible with Trackmaster 1. But, let's try it. So, Paxton goes up. Okay, it's like you can't, he's, 
his body's too high to raise to hit the trigger below. But let's try Gordon with some training chucks. Let's try the shame of it. The shame of it. Oh, the shame of it. Okay, this will take a few seconds to get ready. Time for some chaos. <laughs> Chaos complete. Just by launching Gordon with a truck. <laughs> Come on, Gordon, let's go retrieve the stone. Come on, Gordon, let's retrieve the stone. He did it! Somehow or another, he did it! And he did not get the stone. Oh yeah, Diesel retrieved it. Never mind. There we go. Now he's got it. Well, let's see how the stone will fly. Yeah, well, I still have to track. Anyways. I'm gonna have a lot more fun with this set. I'm gonna leave you guys here. Thanks for watching this fun video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe for more pony videos and cos videos and all the other good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. And hopefully, not sure if it'll happen, but hopefully I can go to Los Angeles. I need to have a fundraiser for this. Bye! Yeah, hold on, sign up before you go. But I just want to show my recent one real edition to my Thomas collection. I got a two birthday Thomases here that I was able to pick up. Not gonna say where, but I got him and I got an older Thomas that's covered up in confetti. He's in the celebration Thomas. I'm guessing some of that celebration Thomas pack. He's definitely in learning curve. And then we got this one which I'm guessing is Mattel. Yep, it's this 2012 Mattel on the wheels. You can't really tell, but it does say I'm guessing it's from some other birthday pack as well. Oh yeah, and also guys, I'm actually putting up on eBay right after I upload this video. I'm putting up this 2014 duck that I got for Easter. And I consider it to be a surplus because I already do have a duck just like this in my bin. Let's go get him. See, he's right there. But anyways, guys, if you want to acquire this beautiful wooden railway duck, feel free to look them up in the dis link in the comments bo section below, or the description below, I mean to say. And you'll find a link to get this guy off of eBay. So anyways, now this is it, and bye.